Hey guys, Super Horror Bro Mike here, and in today's video, we are continuing our playthrough of Still Wakes the Deep. Now, in the previous episode, we just came up this elevator through this crazy looking like hive that the alien, whatever it is, has built infection or just life form that's infecting everyone has built. And uh, we just sort of flooded the bottom legs of this oil rig we're on. If you haven't followed the story of the game up to this point, I'd recommend doing so. Just watch the other episodes because there's so much to explain. Basically, long story short, we're on an oil rig. We're playing as Kaz, who's running from the law. So he got a job on an oil rig. He's trying to get back to his wife, Suze, and his two children. And this alien virus that they drilled into that escaped from rocks below the rig has now overtaken the place and uh, started infecting and mutating all the crew members. So we're trying to get off. Uh, the helicopter crashed in the last episode, so now we're trying to figure out another way to get off this place, potentially by raiding back to the mainland. With all that said, let's continue our playthrough, let's walk through this door, let's see what awaits us next. Okay, let's go. How can I fucking stand this cold? Jesus. You need to find a heater, I think. Warm up. We've just been in that water. Freezing cold water and the oil for ages. Oh, what's this? Examine. The Trawler Men. From 12 Coastal Poems by Craig Henry Campbell. O'er the fullerman huddled close together in flock against the winter brine. Black shrine the stone echoed sounds. Home to yellow lights of trawlers strayed and bound. By heavy midnight calm upon the shoals of cold north singing, old beards grip upon the tiller. Down below the faded boards and hand-smoothed tokens speak of scrabbles lost and won. The morning watcher turns her gaze to see, where turns spill the clouds and her changes slumber on beneath their blankets spun on shingled home. We do not miss you, precious weans, though as we sleep waves break the bow. Though storms gather beneath the brow of winter, and woolen gathers now the clouds, and still wakes a deep, and still on we plow. All right, I don't fully get that, guys. I'm not very good at uh, deciphering, deciphering poetry, so uh, I'll let you guys work that one out. We're gonna heat ourselves up, though, now. We've been in the water for too long. How do you get out of this fucking place? That's right, Kaz, you warm yourself up. We need to get Thank home. Christ. I better check on Roy. Right, check on Roy with the phone, where's that? Oh, here. Okay, it's night time now. We've been down there a long time. Roy, fuck's sake. Oh, Kaz, for the Lord. I've been worried sick. I'm sorry, pal. I've been away at the shop since I last seen you. What's going on, Kaz? What happened with the chopper? I tried to go without this, but... Well, didn't it work out well for him or the bird? Bloody hell, Kaz. Is anyone alive? Aye, I saw Finlay. We had to get the Jennies on, and Brody as well, helping with the tension legs. Do you know what? I'm a fucking rig expert now. <laughs> told you to take no time. Yeah, I'm glad you've not been alone out there. Uh, those two are all right. I saw O'Connor. He's one of the things, but I thought... Ah, fuck, I don't know what I thought, but... Whatever it is, folk are being turned into, there's something of them still in there. What's going on? Roy? Uh, it's, it's all right. Um, it's just me being clumsy. Once I get my shot, I'll be right as rain. Do you need me to come and get you? No, no, I can do it. Uh, you saw this rig out? Find a way to get us home. See you girls. All right? Hi. You're a good lad, Kaz. That's why Suze loves you. And she does, you know. She really loves you. Kaz? Hi. Sorry, I have to go, Roy. Will you make it to the cabins, all right? Yeah, I'm on my way now. You, uh, be on yours. I'm praying for you, mate. Remember, Jesus loves you, Kaz. Everyone else thinks you're on this. <laughs> all right, pal. Afters. Okay, so Roy's still on his way to get his insulin. Um, something just blew up over there, I think. Roy's a good guy. I hope he's okay. I hope he doesn't, like, die or something on the way. <laughs> anyway, we've got to get outside. Oh, the phone's ringing again. Let's have a, a little answer of that. 
Hello? Hello? Anyone there? Listen, I, I don't have long. I left away my mum. I had to get out. She's hurting me. I'm going up my head. Susan! Is that you? Uh, oh, Jesus! <laughs> this one's trying to give me a kick in and all. Going to be a wee boxer, eh? Aye, uh, you wish. I wish I could see you. You're beautiful like this. Aye? Well, I feel like an elephant. Christ, what is this? Sus! Sus! That's weird. So he's hearing what sounds to be like memories of him and his wife, Suze. He's like getting the memories, playing through the phones. I don't know if he's hallucinating. Maybe he's infected with this weird like alien virus thing. Very strange. We'll uh, keep going, I guess. I don't know where we're meant to be going right now. Look at that. The whole place has been overtaken by the alien goop. <laughs> Where are we going? This way? Wow. This game's got some stunning looking moments, you know. Just kind of like creepy looking though, isn't it? Shit, that's oil dripping and everything. One spark and fuck. Alright, so yeah, don't light a cigarette or a match or anything like that right now. Would be very bad. Jesus Christ, what the fuck is happening to me? Ha. Okay. I'm going to keep going. This is very strange. It's very trippy. Look at that. Woo! All right, we're going to keep going, guys. We're going to figure out how to get off this rig, get back to our wife and, uh, and our kids. Look at that. Just burning away. What's this all about? Jesus. That's not right. That doesn't look right. I don't know why that's on fire. Maybe it's meant to be. I think we, that was on fire at the start of the game. Where do we go? Up? The only way is up. Just like the song. Alright, let's climb the ladder. Cash! Oh, we got a friend. Cash! Brody. Over here. Brody. Brody. In hell, how you doing? Better than you, by the looks of it. Did you see any others? You mean anyone alive? Well, I spoke to Roy. He's no doing great without his insulin. And I've no idea where Finley is now. I spoke to her a few minutes ago. She's stuck until she gets past Rennick. Or what used to be Rennick. Feels like everybody's deed or worse. I don't know about your side of the pontoons, but where I was, the oil tanks are burst, and I think there's a gas leak. I mean, <laughs> I'm looking for a fucking bright side here. Well, let's cross that bridge when we come to it, all right? Right now, we have to deal with the stack. <laughs> that noise! Aye, okay. All right, the stack. I'm kind of thinking the flare shouldn't be looking like that. No, the main feed's ruptured. It's burning out. It could get worse. And if it does, it could spread to the derrick and cause an explosion. Right, so we're fucked. Again. Not if we switch the flare onto the auxiliary gas pipe. If you go over to the processing quad, I Wait, can... What? Have you seen it out there? Oh, aye, it's quite nice in here, you know. Maybe we should swap. You can't even work the controls, Cass. Otherwise, I, of course, I'd go myself. Christ. All right. All right, what am I doing? You need to get there and find the diverter valve, main to the auxiliary. It's on the middle floor, flare side. I'll ignite the stack from here. Right. If I can't do it, then you'll need this. Jesus. I'll be on the tannoy if you need any help. Good luck, Kaz. Great. Wait, so we've got to go out there and light this ourselves? No, what the heck, bro? What's this all about? Note from Finley to Brody. I dug the radio out, but there's no signal, no nothing. You know what you have to do. This is our problem. Okay. Well, it's my problem now, our problem, guys. We're gonna have to go and sort this out ourselves. 
processing quad, okay? Where are we going? Through here? Yes. I can hear that weird deer guy just screaming and wailing. I don't like it. He's found his way out here. Okay, let's just shimmy across this ledge. No, no one's here. No one is here. Don't worry. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Shouldn't really be looking down right now, but we are. Ah! Go, go, go! Okay, we made it. We're good. We're good. We're fine. Now we go down. Um, close. Alright, operate. Okay. We're gonna go and light the, uh, the flare, guys. Flare stack that way. Okay. Wait, the, the lift's broken. Classic. Oh. Oh no! He's coming for us! No! Leave us! What the heck? He literally almost got in and then he gave up. That's really weird. I'm not going to complain though. So Adair's here with us. No one's here. Don't worry. Don't worry. Go, 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 go! Ah. Oh my god, man. This is actually horrible. This is... Bro, can I hit that? What does that do? Oh, it draws, it draws him away, guys. Look, he's going there. Okay. So we're gonna go this way. Can I go through here, actually? That's probably the better way to go, right? We can't go this way. It's on fire. Where do I go? Where do I go? Shut up, Brody. This is not the time. Okay, got to turn this off. We turn off the flames. We can make our way through now and get this event. Get to the event. How do we do this, though? Do we have to, like, aggro him? Is this thing I can throw? Oh, yes. Right, guys, watch this. What we'll do... Chuck this over there. Yep. Right, where's he going? He's going that way. Run. Go, 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 go. We made it, we made it, we made it, we made it. Okay, good. Ugh. All right, let's turn this. Shut that flare off. And he's going to light it again properly, I think. Has that done it? Of course you can't, because I'm not that fucking lucky. <laughs> yeah, we're going working. out there. The gas is pulled back toward the wreck. I'm sorry, guys. I need you to do it manually. It's too dangerous to leave it. You'll have to head out onto the stack and use the relighter again. Fuck. Did you hear me, Kaz? Wave or something so I know you're receiving. Prick. <laughs> Understood. God speed. Okay, so we've got to go and lie to ourselves. I knew that would happen. As he said, we're not that lucky. So, we're going to have to make our way out onto that thing. And, uh, yeah, basically use the flare to light uh, the flame once again. This would be my nightmare. Heights, I do not get on well with them. Now he's coming for us. Wait, what? i got to run. Damn it! Okay, jump. Parkour skills, go. Go! Don't slow down. Open it. Go, 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 go. Faster, faster. Come on, Kaz. Run. Ugh. 
jump. Ah. All right, we're almost there. A little bit further, a little bit further. I think we've made it. Oh my god, he's right there. We gotta light this up. I'm doing this. All right, what do we do? Throw it. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> he actually got lit up. Screw you. Surely that's gonna be the end of him, right? He got burned. Oh. Uh. Yeah, I think he's dead. Jesus. Right, let's go. Let's go. Ah. We well we lit it. Uh, and we defeated the monster. Never liked that guy anyway. Go faster, 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 faster. Yes, I can hear you. Oh no. This isn't good. Surely we didn't die. After all that. Gears pieces. Oh, I'm sorry, love. I'm not being difficult. I'm just trying to pick up the pieces of your mess. He wouldn't let it go, okay? He's carried a fucking torch for you since school. He's always hated me for being the bigger man and for having you and those beautiful fucking wings. Oh, no. Bigger man! You are shitting me, McCleary! You're the bigger man! Do you think your daughter's got more brains and bigger bars than you have? What about the kids? The flat's in your name, you go to Berlin and they just take it away! Listen, sirs, come on! No, no, you just you shut it, McCleary! You sit your ass down and you you just listen to me! How could we not just talk about this? Because I am smarter than you, that's why. And I will not, I will not let you drag those girls down to you. You sort this! Whatever you have to do, I don't care. If you sort this one, I will leave you. You understand me? Suze, look, I'm really sorry. God, just enough, okay? Just, just get out of my sight. Try not to put anyone else in hospital the day, yeah? That might make a nice change for you. So, uh, yeah, that's the backstory of how or why he beat up that Billy Chamberlain guy. Billy Chamberlain insulted his, uh, his wife. No, I didn't mean that. Why do you have to... Ah, Suze. Jesus Christ! Oh fuck! Jesus! Jesus! What have I done? Oh, Jesus Christ! This is not good. Are we oh, hanging upside down? Bastard! I think we were. We're not anymore. Okay, so we, we are still alive. We fell all the way down from there onto the bottom of a rig. Look at that. It's okay. We're gonna get out of this mess one way or another. So, I guess we make our way back to our friends on the rig and try and figure out what to do next. I don't know if that was meant to happen or that. <laughs> I don't think it was. All right, turn on the flashlight because I can't see much. I feel like we're getting to the end of this game now. We just defeated a dare, which was like one of the big bads. This fucking stuff doing to me. Yes, weird. We it's like we're hearing our wife's voice in our head. It's kind of like because of the flashbacks as well, where we see all that weird stuff on the screen. I'm thinking that this um, this virus or whatever it is is getting inside our mind and like making us. Um, how oh, oops. I just fell into the water. I think that's the first time I've died, honestly. Which is strange. Um, yeah, I think it's getting inside our head and it's basically bringing back all our like worst memories and stuff, right? It's sort of playing on our fears to try and control us. That's just my estimation of things. I went the wrong way last time. We were meant to go this way. Okay. But yeah, it's strange because the game doesn't really explain what anything is. You kind of have to work it out for yourself, which I kind of like. You can like theorize about it and stuff. Oh. Okay. It's fine. I'm just going to make my way around here. Look at all this. It's like um, when you go to the theme parks and you see all the like alien structures around the roller coasters and stuff on the themed rides. It's pretty cool. 
Whoa! Don't drop down now. Ah! Okay. It's fine. Just hold on. Just hold on. Okay. Let's go down. And now we open this. Leave the area. Nice. Back to engineering. We seem to go to engineering quite a lot in this game. I suppose it's where things get done. It's good to be back outside out of the rain. Although there's like lots of monsters and stuff patrolling these halls, aren't there? <laughs> Don't know what's better actually, being outside or being inside. For some reason I feel more safe inside though. It's this note. It's uh, from Brody to Finley. Finley, there's no way through. Engineering is full of oil. We can do this. I don't want to give up. We can get out. We lost Kaz, but we can sort this out. But don't do anything stupid. Well, you didn't lose us. We're still alive. Don't just give up on us that easily. We've got to be in the water again. Ugh. Not the cleanest water. Couldn't drink this. It's probably salt water, isn't it, to be honest? For fuck's sake! What's happening? I don't know why he's swearing suddenly. What's happening now? Oh, here we go. Finley. Jesus Christ. Cleary, how the fuck are you no dead? I thought I was. You fit to help? Christ, can anything help? Aye, if we can cut ourselves loose and quick like, it'll buy us time, maybe enough. Do we even know if anyone's coming? We've been off radio for hours, so I, I should hope so. Finley. Good. Let's... Cats. Thought. Aye, aye, he's a walking, greeting miracle. Are we doing this or no? Aye. We float the rig. I'll dive down and release the tension cables. Hopefully we balance out, maybe end up higher in the water. I'll need you both at marine control. That's right. Hello, can anyone hear me? I'm now stuck up. It is so fucking hot on the accommodation roof. I don't know how long I can look without insulin. He's up on the roof. I have to get him. No. Is anybody out there? You have to get to marine control with Finley. Please. It's a two-man job and we don't have much time. You think Roy does? I can't just leave him. I promised I'd get him home. Ah, let him go. Fine. If you want to go, go. But this place is filling up with gas and oil from the drill to the derrick. God knows where else it's leaking to. I can't recommend it. I know, Brody. But I'm going. I have to. Engineering's your only path up there, and it's flooded, so you'll have to swim. It's a long way. Plan each step, and if you're underwater, stay calm. Oh, aye, that's exactly how that'll go. Enough! You both know what you're doing, so let's go. There you are, Brody. Oh, you're never all right, McCleary. I'm coming, Roy. I'll find you. Okay, so we got to get to Roy and get his insulin to him. He's uh, on his last legs by the sound of it. We're going to have to dive. Ah! All right. I don't like this, being under the water. But we have, no, uh, we have no option. There's all this stuff around us now as well, which doesn't look good. It's kind of affecting our mind. Got another mission, though. We'll be all right. So... Oh, we were here earlier, weren't we? What the heck is that? I think we... Yeah, we came here earlier. I remember. So we've got to go back through the... Um, we've got to go back through the, like, water tanks, I think. Come on, faster. No. Oh, no, I'm not doing it fast enough. Quick. All right, we made it. Climb the ladder. There was a current under there, guys. I couldn't swim very fast. So I had to kind of propel myself forward. Okay, we've got to get down this side now. Three, two, one, go. Ooh. Oh, there's a current going this way now. Okay, can we get up? Yes. All right, where to next? Through here? 
Yeah, it looks like it. We've got to dive underwater. Oh no, that's a current. Come on, swim faster. That's right. Yes, okay. Now let's get out of the water. We're going to need one of those heaters once we've done this, I think, warm ourselves back up. Because that water would be freezing cold. It's coming straight out of the sea. Okay. Climb. There we go. Yeah, this is exactly where we were before, isn't it? I remember this. We had to, like, navigate across here, but it wasn't flooded before. All right, we can't go that way. We'll have to climb up. Because that door's where we, we went through earlier in the game. At least there's no monsters around here, you know, touch wood. Alright, follow the cables, I guess. Always follow the yellow items in video games to understand where you gotta go. Alright, we did it, we did it, we did it. So, where are we going? Down here? Ah! Okay. I just don't know where we're going is the problem. I'm swimming and it's all dark. It's really, really slow swimming through this part because um, there's a strong current. I'm, I'm actually drowning as well. Is there a place I can surface? Yes. Quick. Finally, we're out. Woo, look at all that. All right, we gotta jump it. Yep. Come on, Kaz. Almost there. Oh no. We gotta climb this. We gotta do it quick. Quick, before it collapses. It's kind of disorientating when you're climbing. Can't always see exactly where you're meant to be going. I like how you can always see the player's hands though, that's gonna really be cool. Okay, where to next? Here? Yes. Jump. Ah! Grip! No! What the heck? What am I doing? Swim! Swim! Oh my god, he's swimming so slowly, guys. I'm actually tapping the L3 button to swim faster, and this is still how slowly he's going. Come on! Great. Alright, climb out. That's fine. Okay, we can leave the area. We made it. Accommodation, that is where we needed to go, I think, to get the insulin, right? The cabins. So we've uh, we've got safely to the cabins now. All right, we're coming, Roy. We're coming. We're gonna get your insulin. Fucking ice. Oh, we gotta heat ourselves up. Okay. There we go. Fucking nightmare. That's kind of be real. Come on, guys. Come on, keep it together. Fuck's sake. I don't know if a little heater like that would really do the job after we've just been out freezing cold water, but I guess I guess it does. Enough waiting around. There we go. Phone call. Alright, let's answer the phone. It's her birthday. That's no for months. Suze? What's going on? Yeah, we're definitely tripping out right now. Hearing these weird messages from our past. Like memories being recalled, but over the phone. 
crew lounge. Which way do we go? This way? <laughs> Look at that. That is some weird shit, man. You can save that again. Feel sick. <laughs> Let's get out. Oh! Oh god, look at that guy. Wait, is someone in here with us? Who is that? Oh, look, it's got eyes looking around in it. That's so weird. Alright, let's get out. Into the vents. I would hate it if there's a monster in the vents with us. That would be like the worst. Okay, we're good. Roof access cabins. We wanted to go to the cabins, didn't we? To get the insulin. Shit. Oh, look at that. That's so weird. It's all twisted. It's like The Thing. If you guys ever seen that movie, The Thing, it reminds me of that a little bit. Where do we go? Can I be a fan? Oh. oh, down fucking somewhere. Yeah, there's one here. Don't you worry, screwdriver to the rescue again. And through we go. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Yeah, poor guy. He did not have a pleasant end. Where do we go? Oh, there's events. What the heck was that? I don't even know what that was. I just heard something grabbing at us. Screw this. Oh. Oh no. What is that? Is that that Trots guy? I think it is. We met him in episode one. He's back. Do I drop down? Fuck! Ah! I guess so. Screw this. Oh, the heck. That's kind of grim. Oh, he's right there. Look at him. Uh No. Alright, he's going off. Alright, I'm going... Actually, I can't go that way. Where do I go? Oh, up. Climb, climb, climb. Look. That's not a nice sight. Not a nice sight to behold. Alright, we'll go this way. At least he can't chase us through the vents, to my knowledge. Alright, we'll drop down again. Fuck! Oh! That is grim. Man, that guy's just been completely, what like, mutilated. How did they get like that? Christ, the trots do this. Probably. Oh, God! He's right there. He's right there. Roof access. Come on, I'm so close. Okay, can I go through here? It's locked. Guys, it's locked. Screw this. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. All right, we made it, we made it. So now what we gotta do is get this off. It sounds like he's behind us, though. Pop this off. Go, 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 go. Should be alright for a minute. Oh, man. It's getting worse. Screw this. I'm getting out. No! He's coming in! He's coming in! Go, 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 go! 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 This is like my worst nightmare. Ah, look at him coming for us! Screw you, buddy! Through, through, through! Okay, we made it. I don't like this. This is too much. Where's this insulin we need? Oh, we gotta go through here. Oh. 
Oh, is this it? Roy's insulin is here. Yes. Right, we got what we needed. Now we need to find Roy and get out of here in one piece. So let's go. Ah! He's got us. Oh. Sorry, Trots. He uh, he got crushed. I guess that's the end of him. That's two monsters down now. I think the only one left is Renick, maybe? That horrible, like, boss. Who's a giant head, wasn't he? Right, back outside. Roy! He up here! Roy! All right, he's, I think... He's over here, I think. Jesus. Let's move on all the other place. Look at that, man. That's getting worse. It's like a huge spire now. That must be it. Thank Christ. Roy! Roy. Roy. Talk to me, big man. We've got your insulin, man. Come on. Roy. No. Roy, wake up, you prick. He's gone. Please wake up. Wake up. Come on. We're too late after all that. Oh, you bastard. Don't leave me here. Please, back my corner, back. Christ, don't leave me. Roy, don't leave me. I can't do this, man. I'm scared, Roy. I'm fucking terrified. What am I going to tell Susan? I mean, she's gonna fucking kill me, man. Huh? She loved you, big man. She really loved you. So did my girls. I mean, what were we gonna tell them? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Your Uncle Roy's not coming home. I know. Me and Ollie. I love this big man, do you hear me? I love them. Oh man. He actually died. Talk about a wasted trip. Poor Roy. Rest in peace, big man. Use the heater, I guess. Just warm ourselves up a little bit after that. All right, phone is ringing. Who's this? Who's this? Finley, Kaz. You got to know. Good. Look, Kaz, the wall's up to admin, so how can they get to marine control? You need to try and get there from where you are. All right? Jesus. Aye. And that English bastard better come and off. You can't stay in that hut forever, no. Kaz? Kaz, are you still there? When you're not shouting, I start to worry like. Is Roy making a fuss? Put him on. I'll get him tail. It's not gonna happen. Kaz, for fuck's sake, what's going on? Roy's no coming. Ah, oh, Jesus. Kaz, did you not make it? I was too late. I'm sorry, Kaz. No. We all loved the big man, eh? I let him do. He was relying on me. No, no. No, you did everything you could. You went back for him. None of this is your fault. It's no anyone's. Look, I'm sorry, Kaz, but we need your help here. We're all fucking good doing otherwise. Aye. I want half this fucking Rick. Good. Then you need to find a way across the deck. Get to marine control room and call me when you get there and I'll talk you through it, all right? Right. So we've got another mission now to get to marine control. We're gonna have to leave Roy behind, guys. This is where his story ends. But ours continues. We can't let him die in vain. We've got to try and get off this place. Back to our wife and children. So, let's head on down. Uh, climb here, I guess. 
Oh, where are we going? Gotta climb this precarious scaffold. Up the ladder. All right. Now we gotta jump that. I think we gotta do more parkour. All right, go. We made it. It's all right. Climb. Yes. Okay, we're on. Slowly now. Steady. Look at that, guys. That's incredible. That is a, a big drop. So let's make sure we're holding on to the monkey bars tight. Drop. All right, we made it. Oh, we've got to go around the outside. Ooh, this is not a good idea. Take it slowly, step by step. Ah. It's okay. Hold. Hold. It's gonna be okay. Oh! It's tilting! It's tilting! No! Just hold a little bit more. We're almost there. Almost there, guys. Ah! Oh! Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, we made it. Now we just gotta jump this. Man, that is swaying. That is swaying. Okay, I'm gonna wait for it to come back. Go. Ah! Okay, we made it. We're good. We're good. Okay. Man, this is actually kind of nerve wracking. Especially for someone like me who does not like heights. It's not the best. Whole place is on fire as well. There's oil everywhere as well. It can't be good that there's fire like breaking out all over uh, all over the place. Alright, down we go. Nice. So this must be the control room we needed to get to, yep. Oh. Rob. No you at all. Nice and slow. That's all right. I just need to make a call. Yeah? Hi. Right. Here we go. Okay. Make a phone call. That guy is completely uh Family. completely gone. I'm at Marine Control. I'm uh I'm not alone. Fuck. So that no, no, no. Jesus. Jesus. It's... it's Roper. He's all messed up. Cass, listen to me, all right? Listen. All right. We need to keep it together. All right, just tell me what to do. There's only two switches. You just have to find them. First, find the ballast operations panel. There'll be a switch there to put it into manual control. You flip that switch. Go do that. Then I'll talk you through the next part. All right? Hi, all right. I'll look for it. Okay. He's got something in his hand. What is that? Can I get close to him? A key. Let me take that. It's all right, pal. Here we go. I'll look after this now. All right? <laughs> Yeah, we'll keep Renick away, man. Just hang tight. You can't do much else. Okay. So what do we do? This control panel? Examine. Christ, it's way above my pay grade, this. Ballast override. Warning, these switches are intended for emergency use only. Tension leg cable controls must be disabled before using these switches. Ensure all personnel have left the pontoon areas before using these switches. Well, someone's down there, but... Where do we need to go? Do this? Yes, unlock it. This is what she said to use first, I think. That's done. Call Finley again. 
Okay. Switch is it, Manuel? Right. What's next? Now you flood the formal pontoon, and I mean flood it to the fucking brim. Now hold on a minute. The pontoons are already fucked full of oil and gas. This might push it all up to the deck. We don't have a choice. The whole rig could tip over. Flooding that pontoon will at least give us a fighting chance. What about Brody? Is he not down there? He'll be out of there by now. He's done his part. We just have to do it all. Right? All right. It's coming for me. My keep him away. All right, man. We'll keep him away. It's Roper. Never mind him. What the fuck, what pontoon? I, I, hang on. All right, we've got to go and flood the pontoon. You just stay there, dude. <laughs> um, so we need to go over here. She said the port pontoon, right? Oh, no, this one, because this one's empty. All right, do this one. Okay, it's done. Back in we go. All right, that's done. Now what? That's it. Come on, come on. Come on, what? It's moving. Did it work? Fucking aye. See, not the whole was after all. Eh? Oh, thank Christ, finally. What now? Brody's got a plan. Meet us in drill ops as soon as you can. Okay, I'll meet you there. We're going to be all right, Cass. Yeah, I fucking hope so. Okay, we did it. Mission complete. We're on our way home, I think. Oh! Get off! Get off me! Nasty little thing. You stay there. You can go down with a rig. I mean, it's not really his fault. It's kind of like possessed by the alien stuff. <laughs> Whatever it is. But still, screw him. Jeez. Fuck! Am I losing my mind? I think so. I think that's exactly what's happening. Where do we go? Exit this way? What the heck? No! Why can never why can nothing ever be simple? I'm getting, I'm getting washed away again. Man, I cannot see anything right now. It's so dark. Oh, we can go up. Shade that was close. In this case we did want to move towards the light. Usually you don't. I don't know. Oh! What the heck is that? Screw that. I'm out. Shit. Oh no, it's flooding. It's flooding, guys. Go, go, go. Faster, faster, faster. Quick, quick, quick. Nice. Right, we keep we keep going, we keep going no matter what. The water is coming up all around us so no Oh great. Okay. I don't know what to do. Oh there's a, actually there's a there's an air pocket. What the heck is that? Is there another monster still? I thought we killed all the monsters. Rennick is still alive. Maybe it's Rennick. The big head thing. I don't know. Oh. There's another air pocket. Let's move towards the air pocket. Quick. Oh, look at that. That's like thumbnail material. That's horrible. Okay. Ooh, more air. <sighs> Just take a gasp of air and keep moving. That's what I say. 
There's another one here. We're out. God. All right, we made it. Thank goodness. Oh, phone call. Shush! Shush! Where's... Where are you? Shush! Yeah, this thing is playing on his fears, I think. Jesus. Fears of his, like, children, like, being lost and stuff. And his wife distressed. Might even be a memory, I don't know. I have no idea whereabouts we are now. What is that? I think that's Rennick, and he's stalking us, guys. So I'm gonna run. No! Oh, great. Well, at least maybe the current's taking us away from whatever that thing was. Ow. Hit my head. Ow. I hit my head again. And again. Great. This isn't going too well. I literally can't see, though, so I don't know what I'm even meant to be doing now. Oh. Air. Quick. Jesus. Don't think about it. Don't think about it. We made it. I actually thought I was going to drown that time. I was getting quite scared. <laughs> okay. To the roof. That does not sound good. Hello? Man, I'm actually nervous. No, it is Renick. He's coming. I'm running, but I can't run because of the water. Ah, uh, he's coming for us. Go, 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 go. Quick. Faster. Ah. I think he's dead. I don't know where we're going though. Quick, faster, faster! <sighs> Holy moly! I that I thought that was game over. Oh, Jesus, Jesus, that was. Man, oh, fuck. at least he's dead now. He drowned. You rest in peace, you. Christ. Yep. I've got to get the fuck out of here. Well, Renix drowned. We've taken care of all the monsters, I think, now at this point. So, we can leave the area. That's good. Whew, that was actually getting my heart pounding, guys. We are running and we started drowning afterwards. I did not like it. We're in drill operations. Finley, thank fuck. Here she is. Finley? What's going on? Who are you talking to? You made it. Brody, what's wrong with Finley? She's freaked out here. Listen, Kat. There's no much time. There's oil and gas getting in here. When it fills, it will be headed right up the drill pipe. What are you on about? I'm still in the pontoons. I've only got a couple of minutes. I can't stop it. The rig's a time bomb now. You understand? One spark and... You need to find a way off. Just get back up here and we'll work it out, yeah? I can't do that. What? I can't get back up. Wait, no way. I'm sorry. Wait, listen. You're on your own now. I'll come to you. All right? No, you won't. You wouldn't even get halfway to me. The legs flooded and the gas. It, it's not possible. You got your dive gear? Aye. Yeah, so you can use that? It's oil, Kaz. There's nothing to be done. Don't fucking see that. I knew the risk when I came down here. Fuck. I can't lose you as well. Listen, I'm alright, Kaz. I'm... 
I'm already back on Sky. <laughs> You've never seen water like that get as clear, peaceful. <laughs> you just let go and <laughs> everything's fine. Hi. That sounds beautiful. You go one day. <laughs> All right. No, fuck that. I'm never swimming again after this. <laughs> You and Finlay, you could do this, alright? I'm sure she wouldn't do something so stupid. Brody, you there? Kaz? What's stupid? Talk to me. It's getting higher. Alright, I'm here, Brody. I'm not going anywhere. Alright, I'm here. Get him! Brody. Oh, fuck. Man, Brody. We've, we've lost Brody now. We're losing everyone. No one's gonna survive at this rate. It's gonna be Cass and Finley. Poor guy. He sacrificed himself for us. Oh, fuck. How does this happen? What are we here now, fella? Doesn't he fucking matter? He's deep and you don't think that matters. He was always gonna die. Boy, them. Always. We see that. We can be fucking about with a lakey and pontoons. And we thought, I hope, male. Watch new pals turn into monsters. Never once. Never fucking once. Have we tried to do what needed to be done? What's she doing? Come back. Finally! Is she gonna blow this place up? After all of we've done? That's insane. Yeah. Man. Finley! Wait, wait Come back! You're not thinking straight! Yeah. What the heck's she doing? Man, she's locked us out. Open it. She's she's trying to get away, guys. She's gonna try and blow this place up, I think. Go! Finally! I can't even run, I've got like a, a limp or something. We have to find a way out, come on! Where's she going? No! Oh man! She better not blow this place up after all of this. Where do we even go? Just keep going down the stairs, I guess. We can't take the elevator. Come on! Go, 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 go! Oh man, the whole place is coming down. Wow, okay, whoa, okay. Watch out, watch out. Do not get crushed at this point. Man, we're just limping along. <laughs> we can't even run, it's mad. She got crushed. Oh, Jesus, Finley. <laughs> Fucking hell. Guys. I'm here, Finley, I'm here. What is close? Who do I hear? I hear my wife. I just want to get back to her, Finley. To my wings. I hear my boy. When he was we, you know. I hear him now. He's singing. We're not seeing him again. There's got to be a ship coming. You, you said it yourself. Christ, God. We don't want them coming. Oh, Jesus! Fuck. I'm sorry, Philly. I don't know what we do. We've got to face it, Kaz. What do you mean? Ah! We can't get back. We can't. But I can't. There's no going to stop with us. 
Fuck's sake, McCleary. For once to her life. Be brave. Be brave for them. You can't save yourself. But you can save them. Jesus, Finlay. You want to leave it a chance? If it gets to the mainland. Oh. You know I'm right. I'm always fucking right. We gotta blow up ourselves? I guess to stop it getting back. Like she says. Alright. 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 Follow him. She's dead. Oh man. That's kind of cool though because if you remember at the start of the game we gave Finley our lighter and now she's returned it to us so we can do one final mission which is to blow this paranormal alien thing up. So, um, yeah, kind of a heavy ending if we're going to do this, but I guess, you know, like, it's the only way to stop the infection getting back to the mainland and, like, turning the rest of, you know, the population of Earth into these monsters, I guess. So we're going to have to do the brave thing by destroying it ourselves and putting an end to everything. But it means we'll never see our wife and kids again. It's kind of sad. All our friends have died. Look at this. This is insane. It looks so cool. There's like spores in the air. I wonder if the spores are what infect people. Like they breathe from in or something. You can see it kind of affecting us now, can't you, as we're breathing it in. Oh, Christ. We never had a chance. That's the drill that drilled into it. It came out the ground after we drilled in at the start of the game. All right, let's do this. Oh man, you can hear it's got like a heartbeat. Sorry, Zeus. So, so sorry. All right, here goes nothing, guys. The Big Bang. Let go. Whoa. Just roasted it. I think he's pretty much dead now, right? <laughs> I think he's gonna survive that. He survived a lot of things, but explosion on an oil rig, probably not. Well, what's happening now? You don't recognize me, do you? No, sorry, love. You know me. You could say that. It's been a long time though, Kaz. Hold up. Susan Lafferty, fuck's sake, is that you? The very same. Christ, Kaz, but you look no different. I've still got the nose, eh? <laughs> well, looks like someone did a good job of spreading it about your face. <laughs> <laughs> so that's when he met his wife again. Oh, the big man a drink. Jesus, Kaz. Because I really want to be thinking about Roy right now. <laughs> he looks after me. He fucking adores you, you know. Well, I am easy to love, Cameron McCleary. Yeah. I'm finding that. Shut up, great Suki Jim. I do know, Suze. I fucking love you. I love you more than anything in this whole world. Did that fan Paul? Were you not so bad yourself, all things considered? Marry me. What? I'm serious. Marry me. We make beautiful wings. I want to spend my whole life with you. So he's kind of going into the afterlife now, I think. This is showing him transcending to the afterlife and remembering all the best She's memories. Perfect. She looks just like you. Thank God for that. <laughs> She's got your eyes, though. <laughs> my dad's eyes. I'm sorry, Kaz. I would have wanted him to meet her. Nah, fuck him. The bastard wasn't interested in me. Why would he care about her? He loved you in his way, Kaz. I'll never leave you, Susan. I'll be at your side forever. And I'm always going to be here for this wind. Kind of failed on that one. Yes, I think that was him remembering his like fondest memories as he moves into the afterlife. Kind of sad. Kind of making me feel sad. Oh. It was all a dream. Is 
Is that our wife asleep? Wait, let's have a look. Examine. These are like pictures. I guess that's him. He's pretty tall, he's got a moustache. On our wedding day. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's our wife there asleep. Okay, I guess these are our two children. And we've got some pictures. Yeah, there's the two children. That's his wife when they were very little. Some pictures that the kids have drawn. Great artwork. Okay. I guess we just go outside. Kiss the wings for me. Tell them I'll be back for Christmas. I'm sorry, Suze. Oh, this is him, like, remembering his final day when he left in the morning. I get it. That's, like, his final memory of him and Suze. Hey, Cass. I'm sorry it's been so hard. I just wanted to send you this. To say we'll get through it. I know we will. Just take care out there and bring my beautiful big gallus man back home in one piece, okay? I miss you, and I love you. And the girls miss and love you. I'm still raging at Roy, but... He's a good man, and I know he'll look after you. Whatever happens, we will be all right. We can weather this. Just wanted to say that to you, Kaz. To keep you safe and close and make sure you know to come home to us. I love you, Cameron McCleary. Be safe out there on those waters. My man. My love. Okay guys, well that was the end of the game. Quite a moving ending there. Choked me up a little bit. It was definitely a really cool horror game. It had a lot of story to it. But, you know, kind of like less gameplay, more story. But the story was so well written and performed by the actors that I think, you know, it didn't really matter that it prioritised over the gameplay itself. I think it was re done really well. And I liked that it didn't, like, reveal too much about what the alien entity was. Like, you don't even know if it really was, like, a true alien entity. It's just something that came out of the core of the Earth when they drilled into the ground. Was it always there? Who knows? But the game doesn't really give you any answers. It's just for you to piece together what you think it is. But the story was straightforward apart from that, like, pretty easy to understand. Guy goes to an oil rig to escape uh, a crime he's committed back home, leaves his wife and children. But then while he's aboard the rig, this alien entity overtakes it, infects everyone, turns them into monsters, and he has to basically destroy it in order to stop it from ever reaching home again, sacrificing himself and his other crewmates in the process. So, pretty easy to understand story-wise. But yeah, it's... A good game guys and I thoroughly enjoyed it and hopefully you've enjoyed my playthrough of Still Wakes the Deep. Of course there's a link in the description if you want to check it out. It's on Steam, it's on Xbox, I think it's on Game Pass and it's also on PS5. So plenty of places where you can play it. I was actually playing on PS5 myself. So yeah guys, that's Still Wakes the Deep. Hopefully you enjoyed my playthrough. Great little game there and uh, yeah one of the longest series I've done on the channel in recent memory. So it was nice to have a longer playthrough up. If you did enjoy the video and this series, I'd appreciate it if you can leave a like, comment down below, and of course subscribe for more videos just like this one, and I'll see you all on the next one.